so we pulled up at the property once again the other one meet with the plumber so they can mark these lines and everything we got the whole family with us Just going to the water company and yeah i would i mean to start i mean are you doing all the work yourself no i'm uh okay then I'm, yeah. okay uh, well the meter start but probably still be on you to do that and then the deposit and mm -hmm. yeah once you get the meter here i'll get you water and that way they can have water to do their stuff and then when you get your plan you know what I mean? Uh, we could put sleeves through all any, any of your footers into the foundation so that we're just ready to go right out. A little water sewer. Okay, so how to... And then this, you give me a set of prints and I can give you a price on what everything will cost. The... I mean, you can explain to them a little bit because you're the one designing, designing it. Well, the house layout is uh, 16 feet this way, 50 feet this way and two bathrooms on, on either end of the house. So okay. this side is a small bathroom with just a toilet sink and a small shower. That side is a full bathtub, sink, and toilet. Yeah, and in, in the middle of the house is the kitchen. Kitchen sink, mm -hmm. washing machine. Yes, in the water middle. Water heater, couple yep. hose bibs. Well, the water water doing heater. A, doing a tankless, okay. tankless uh, hot water right. heater. Okay. Right. Do you have a set of prints that we could get a copy of? We'd have to print it, or you want to email? You can email it to our shop. You have our shop email, or do you want to? You can call our office and, get, and, uh, and give get it to them. And, and yeah, okay. if you give me a set of prints, I can give you a, a good quote on, you know, cost on what it's all going to cost. Okay. And then uh, generally we'll do like thirty percent down, fifty percent up on the rough end, you know, and then once you get it ready to set fixtures, the last twenty percent. So this is my first time doing a new construction build. Okay, and that, that's what I was going to ask you if you were ever done with that in the city. Because first thing you'll want to do is get your, your silt fence around and then get your stormwater box. Okay, storm stormwater silt fence. And and the city might be able to help you with all that too. You know what I mean? But at least that way you're not going to catch any flack from anybody saying, hey, you're doing construction here and you don't have the right stuff. I, you know. Now, would, would that be more on my... Um, your contractor would handle all that. Yeah, my yeah, my per yes. people do my foundation and everything. Yes. Okay. Yes. What? But make sure you talk to them about that, because sometimes they don't want to do it, and you'll have to hire. And uh, there's a couple companies that do it. Uh, you know, you've seen them around when they do a, a job like this. Mm -hmm. They want to see a porta potty on site, uh, a silt fence around it. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And then your water. You know, have you a nice temporary water so that the concrete guys can get all the work that they need done. You know, and uh, yeah, we'll just go from there. It'll be your footers, your block work, mm -hmm. and then get it framed up, and then we'll come plumb it, and then you'll be sheetrocked and trim it out. Okay. It'll be a little bit different because the building is a prefab building. Okay. And so they have the foundation, and then they're gonna bring it out and set it in. Okay. Wow. So it's pretty much the same thing. It won't. Yeah, that'll be the same to me. Yeah. 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 That's the same thing. Instead of, I mean, instead of framing it on site, it's going to be just they'll do the foundation and then the whole building, home building, and just assemble it. Yeah. yeah. And then you come in, and so you wouldn't probably run your lines with like that getting in, underneath there. I no, think. no. Okay. I mean, it's, uh, just touch base with me when the foundation guy is here. Okay. Because if I need to put a six-inch sleeve for the sewer line and a two-inch sleeve for the water line in through his footer, mm -hmm. so we're under the house, then I'm fine. Once I'm under the house. We're good to go. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, I didn't want to do it, and then you had to do your part. And be like, oh, we need to 
you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you got to dig under a footer and stuff. No, I'd rather work along. I'll work right alongside with you. You let me know what phase you got going on. And if you think I need to be over here, and I'll come right on by and we'll take a look at it and see. Like I said, you get your water meter and I'll get you hooked up. Okay. So you make a note, call them, see how much it's going to cost. And it's easier because it's our, it, was, it was already pre existing, right? Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, yeah. There's no tap fees or anything. Your sewer's already there and your water's there. Once they bring the water meter, we'll just. Have a temporary water hookup, you'll be able to start construction. Okay. And you just need to send over that um, the blueprint of the, of the house. Yeah, the, yeah. And email us a print with the uh, so I can count up all the fixtures, and then I'll get you a price on an estimate of what it'll cost, and I'll email y'all an estimate. Okay. Does it have to be an official blueprint, like from an no. architect? Okay. I'm just asking. Just, I'm, just making, I'm, I'm just making. I'm just making sure. A, <laughs> you can get a city a drawing. Right. They, they say give us a hand drawing with the walls and everything, mm -hmm. but you know. I'm just asking. I don't no, know what your no, company requires. I don't need official. All I really need to count, you know, I don't even need the first, you know, because it's a wood floor. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. On a slab, you want to know where everything is at, so that way you can yeah. plan it all out. But on a wood floor, once it's here, then I'm gonna come in and plumb it. <laughs> gotcha. In and out. Say be done in two, in two days. <laughs> nah. Well, if it's as, if it's as cut and dry like they're saying, I mean, I could have one done in two or three, in about three days. So this project might go faster and smoother than the already done, already built house. Yeah, that's the that's the goal. The sooner we get them done, the sooner we can. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> go to the next one. <laughs> yeah. It's, all, it's, it's good for everybody, right? right. <laughs> all right, sounds good, sounds good. I'm glad to hear that. So, got that and that. Yeah, the clean out line is good. Right there. not very deep but ground's working with us so we're fine yeah because it's slowed down mm -hmm. oh, now are these the last that the um what's the name of that company eight this is a gas line oh okay because one day supposed to call you to come out and just the 811, 811 folks they put to come out and mark the line do we still need to do that uh we don't need to do that right now because your your 811's got to be done within a week of when we do the work so when we do the utility work to run the line from here to the house and run the water line from there to the house, we'll locate it all then. Okay. Cause they were saying and that's that. just that just covers you for making sure that there's nothing running in your yard that you hit. Yeah, they were, I was told, you know, I'm learning the process to go ahead and call them out because they may be behind and everything. They get here within three days now. Okay. And, and, and with them, you want to have it within a week of whatever work you're doing. So, I mean, when your foundation guy goes to dig, they'll call them. Okay. You know what I mean? Sounds good, sounds good. Yes, sir. So the next step with you is get you those plans. Give me the plans, and then when you get a water meter here, because um, that's the first thing a brick, any any concrete guy or footer guy is going to ask for. I mean, they're going to want some kind of water. Okay. I mean, they can just take, you know, borrow it from a neighbor's house if you talk to a neighbor that's got water, but it's easier for you to just go ahead and get a water meter. you got to get it anyway. Mm-hmm. Well, throughout the construction phase, yeah, you'll just need it. You got anything else? Nope. I'll get you that email today. <laughs> appreciate it, appreciate it. Yes, yes. Hi. How come you're not what? How come I'm not saying anything in the video? Oh, I am. <laughs> well, what are we about to do? Get out. And do what? Look at the back. You think <laughs> it looks good? Mm-hmm. Well, you seen it earlier, right? Yeah, but I want to see it again. Yeah, now it's all cleaned up and everything and painted. Amazing. I want to go, 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 go through there. And go, yeah, I'm going in. I'm creeping out. Got some heavy doors. You scared me. Charles or Marsha or this new wood? Charles. Remember the, the back room? Isn't it, that's where the back room is? Oh, that's the bathroom. Bathroom? Yeah. Plumbing? No, but there was a hole right here, right? Oh, I see it. Somebody, Daddy. Somebody fixed it. I guess Charles. I'm getting creeped out. 
Yeah, we fixed that from the top. Oh, you, Daddy. So, what you think? We come to work. They did amazing. They did better than what I would have done. But I guess they wasn't, you know, they wasn't creeped out. It was junky under here. Whoever used to live on, people used to live under here, y'all. <laughs> I'm a witness to it. Since it's dark enough, I did want to show y'all my security light. LED. All right. You see it's off. It's not real dark out here. Boom. But you see how bright it is. It lights up the whole steps all the way over here. At first we had it angled um, more so this way. Light this up, but that's good enough. And I got another one go right here. So they could put one on the side and one at the very oh, wait, <laughs> the tippy top. But I think uh, that one would be good. And then the other one, and they get a fence, which we're gonna put up a fence when we start on this property. Um, but that's obviously later. They have a little bit of privacy.